tonight. Got her in Nash, take two. All right, so you're under a little bit of pressure from Aaron Huck out there. Is that, was that the case? It looked like the gap came down to about 10 seconds at some point and it would stretch out to almost 40. Yeah. Is that what was going uh, on? That's what it seemed like. No, I mean, there's always pressure, you know, until you cross the finish line and you got it, there's never just, you know, relaxing. And this was a, a really fun course. I really enjoyed like the lack of climbing out there and just riding nice fun swoopy trail so uh, no I had a really really good day and just happened to walk away with a series overall and a good solid training day yeah where were you able to put the pressure on out there where could you actually get uh, separation I think uh, uh, I think riding 27 and a half versus all the 29ers maybe I just was a little quicker zipping around the corners I don't know I mean I don't know I I really like the courses, maybe a little bit more like cyclocross, so I really focus on like acceleration out of the corners and all that stuff, so. How much was that like a cross course, like a bumpy cross course today? Just yeah, how, how it, it totally, was. but I wouldn't want to ride a cross bike. I was happy to have full suspension bike for sure. How, yeah. how big of a tire do you run on 27.5? Do you run a big tire or are you running like two ones or something? Oh, uh, two ones, yeah. That's what kind of pressure? I was running 18 and 19 today, so. Is that is that high for you or is that? I'm bad usual. Yeah, yeah, kind of. They're around 20 typically, you know, but like between, I'd say I run, I typically race 18 to 21, unless it's like long distance race and there's too many rocks, then I might go a little higher, but yeah, about usual stuff, yeah. Right, awesome. Well, thanks for coming out. Thank you, yeah. Thanks. Thank you.